Hi and welcome to this tutorial. Today I'm going to teach you how to use a smart notebook template to create activities for your students using fractions. The template can be found on this page and here's the URL. And when you do download the template it'll look something like this. As you can see there's three slides in the template. The first slide is somewhere where you can just click a few times and insert your own heading and then click a few times and insert your own introduction. The second slide contains squares and lines which you will use to create the pictures uh, of the fractions by simply copying and pasting and the third slide is where you actually put those pictures put in your questions and put in your answers. Now before you put in any questions or answers it's wise to make a duplicate of this page or a clone. So right click on slide 3 which I've done and simply click clone page or if you know the shortcut control D. So now we've got two copies of that same page and it's best to keep one down the bottom which is just blank so if you want to insert another question you can you can just do it there it's it's a blank copy ready to go now on the one above it let's put our first question so we'll type in the blue here I've set that up so just a few clicks and type in number one and insert the question so insert I'll say what fraction of this shape is shaded okay now of course we don't have a shape here but that's why we've got these symbols here now you can choose to have white on shaded or shaded on white um, whatever works for you just simply hold your mouse down and draw a box around the ones that you want could be these ones or these ones and when you've done that right click and copy and then go and paste them onto your question slide so click on that question slide right click and paste okay and there I've got my shapes now all you do is move them into a, uh, a shape of your liking I'll move them together then I'll make another copy of this shaded one or I'll make a clone of it and I'll put it down there okay and I'll clone that again and I'll move it over here so obviously three quarters of this shape is shaded so let's insert our answer here we can uh, we can write it as a sentence and then put it in numeric form as well so we can say three quarters of this shape is shaded and then down here this is set up to put in fractions so we'll double cl oh, click a few times on that black line and put three and then click a few times on that black line down the bottom and put four and then cover it with your screen shade so you've now got a question ready to go and you can discuss it with your class before revealing the answer okay then as I said you've got this spare slide down the bottom to insert another question so once again let's make a clone of this so we can type in question 2 here and we've still got a, a spare slide ready to insert the next question so we'll go here we'll type in question 2 okay and for simplicity's sake I'll just write the same sort of question actually I might make it a bit different is colored green okay and for this one I'm going to show you why I actually put the lines here so this time I might take I'm going to hold my control key and I'm going to select the box and one of the lines and this line and then I'm going to right click and all of those will be copied then I'll go down to this slide here which is where we've put our second question right click and paste and the question this time is what fraction of this shape is colored green so what I'm going to do this time is I'm going to 
enlarge the box say so I'll click on the box and then I'll move my mouse over the the circle in the bottom right hand corner make it a bit bigger then I'll move this line uh, this horizontal line over to the box and enlarge it so it covers the box and I'll move this vertical line sort of to the center and enlarge it so it goes the from the hi the height of the box and this time I'm going to use my highlighter tool okay and I'm going to just color in one quarter of this thing green I'm a bit messy there but you get the point okay and once again I can go to my pointer tool click a few times and write a sentence answer uh, one quarter of this shape is colored green and write in the fraction down the bottom one over four once again cover it with the screen shade so you've got your question there for the class you can discuss it and then when you're ready reveal the answer to the students and of course again you've got that slide down the bottom which you can use to make another question as required. I hope you understood and I hope that's useful for you in your classroom. Thanks.